This scene here, it's a thing of the past. This morning's commute will look very different on the Tobin Bridge. Those toll booths out of service for good. And the eye opener Jim Loke is on the road this morning checking out the changes drivers will face. All right, we're going to try to time this out a little bit better this time around, Randy, for you. We're getting out of the Tobin Bridge right now as we head on from Chelsea. Of course, the big changes went into effect last night. Let's show you the video from the first moments after the Tobin Bridge officially went cashless. Here's the deal. When you get onto the Tobin Bridge now, of course, you, everybody still has to pay the toll. The difference here is that you do not stop. If you don't have Easy Pass, doesn't matter. You're still going to continue to go on through the bridge. Pass the toll booths, you bypass the toll booths. If you don't have the easy pass, you're going to get a bill in the mail. There's going to be a statement. Commercial drivers, you'll get a uh, you'll get a bill as well if you don't have the easy pass. And there's going to be a 50 cent surcharge. This is something that MassDOT wants to move to on the Mass Pike as well. In fact, by 2016, that seems to be the plan. But here on the Tobin Bridge this morning, you can see certainly building up now. Last time when we went across the bridge, we didn't see much of a problem. But now, as you take a look uh, at at the bridge here, as we move on from Chelsea, certainly. Is building up as people see the signs say not to stop. By the way, we want to let you know if you're wondering where they take the pictures, where they scan the license plates, where they read your easy pass, it's on the off ramp moving over towards Charlestown, not here anywhere near where the former toll plaza now stands on the Tobin Bridge. Reporting live on the Tobin this morning, I'm Jim Loke, WCBB News Center 5.